Welcome to Material Chef, preparing the most influential materials for your delectation. It is easy to pour, shape and mould. The perfect combination of ingredients makes it fantastic under pressure. Concrete has defined modern life. It is used to bind bricks together. Moulded into intricate statues and aerated to make lightweight building blocks. Used in large quantities, you can make fantastic structures, such as the Sydney Opera House. We're going to use sand as an aggregate to make a concretion of Portland cement and aggregate. Concrete. Different proportions of cement and aggregate can be used to give the concrete different properties. Here we are mixing one part sand to one part cement. Stir with great vigour to ensure an even mix. Add water a little at a time until you reach the required consistency. With our first carefully prepared batch we can fill the first half of our mould and leave it to set. Despite being very hard when set, it is still possible to snap a thin piece of concrete by hand. Mixing a second batch of concrete will allow us to test a way of strengthening the material using reinforcement. Half fill the mould with concrete. Before it is set, we place steel rods along its full length. Cover the rods in another thick layer and allow to cure. When water is added to the cementing concrete, it undergoes a process of hydration. But what is the chemistry behind this? The most important reaction is this. The calcium silicates in the concrete react with the water to form calcium hydroxide and other silicates. These silicates have long, thin, needle-like spikes which interlock with each other, sticking the aggregate together and making the concrete strong. Keeping the concrete wet allows it to cure fully, with all the calcium silicates reacting to form a strong structure. This clear pint glass was left with the same concrete mixture, but this time it was covered with water. When we remove the concrete, we see a dramatic change. It is set into a hard block, even while under water. But what other desirable properties does concrete have? Millbank are manufacturers of pre-stressed and precast concrete products. We use concrete because you can pre-stress it and therefore you can make it more efficient for longer spans and therefore thinner and more lightweight. You can use it as a thermal mass, therefore hold the heat within your building and it's fireproof. Here at Millbank we pre-stress all of our flooring products. This enables it to span further for the same thickness of concrete. The pre-stressing takes the best abilities of the steel in tension and the compressive strength of the concrete, therefore combine the two together to make a very efficient product. The way pre-stressed concrete works is on a mould approximately 100 metres long. The wires or the strands, the steel reinforcement, is pulled along those moulds. At each end they're then clamped into place using something called a carrot, which basically holds the wire in position. You then use a hydraulic jack and put approximately two tonne of pressure on each wire and extend it by just under two meters per wire per 100 meter length to put the pre-stress into the actual concrete itself. At this point there is no concrete around it, it is all done in the air. The concrete is then poured around it, cured overnight for at least 24 hours, enabling the concrete to bond around the pre-stressing wire to hold the stress within the concrete itself. The concrete is then cut to size and sent to site. Now that our two small beams have had time to harden, we can remove the sides of the mould and take them for testing. Just dropping the first beam into two supports causes it to crack and break apart. 
the crack was able to spread across the entire cross section. The beam with steel rods does not break under the same stresses. Even when struck with a hammer, the reinforcement stops cracks from propagating quickly. Here you can see the way that the concrete has moulded itself to the steel rods. Concrete is great in compression. A pile of the sections from the first beam are able to take all of our chef's weight. Whether it's setting Confucian features in a permanent wise gaze, or forming large brutalist urban structures, concrete has cemented its place in our society. Tune in next week to satisfy your insatiable appetite for knowledge and dig into what makes the materials we use just so special. With the Material Chef, brought to you by the Naked Scientists.